Thank you for boosting my confidence. I was a bit shaky, like, hey, after all these powerful speakers, what am I going to tell you that you all know already? As I've been introduced already by Senator, thank you so much. Um, I heard the minister also yesterday uh, greeting him in absentia. The event organizer, I'm deeply humbled by the invitation. I am a social entrepreneur, social activist, analyst from the Kingdom of Marushani, and I've been involved in the sector for almost 20 years now. My journey in life, as is typical of the story of a sojourner with the Pan African vision, has been made possible by many a loving hand, a giving heart, and by a confluence of events and circumstances that only God could comprehend. So before I begin with my presentation, I need to take a bow before the thank you for attending to us though. Okay. Just briefly on the matter of career guidance. I think you people have already had more than enough speeches already, so I'd like to get this in as, as an engagement. Most of us in our post 1980s, we are rather carrying the burden of legacy of having to choose which career option is best for us. What rather is fascinating about the whole spectrum of career choice is that most people settle for passion. The question would be, does your passion pay the bills? To what extent is it sustainable? Those have become the common key words in most round tables. Is your lifestyle within that barricade of horizon sustainable enough to take you to the next level in life? So, in addition to this, let me just say um, I was lately honored by the JCI as being given the honors of being an honorary doctorate in social, social anthropology. And I, f I found it rather humbling to have been among the top 10 in the country, top 100 in the world and top 20 in the country, uh, uh, the one of the youth ambassadors, uh, you know, but endorsed by the office of the president. So within the whole, my whole journey as a social ent uh, entrepreneur, I think I have not necessarily made it yet, but hey, I'm closer to that vision of me having to be become a youth ambassador for the world, if I may so say. So, like I said, most of you are tired of speeches, so let's get this engagement. Any questions? <laughs> <laughs> 